YouTube, what's going on, man? It's your boy, Booba, and welcome back to another play review on the channel. I hope you guys are having an incredible day. In today's video, boys, we're going to go ahead and check out another Future Stars Evolution card. It's none other than Sergio Gomez. Gomez is an 88 rated card. He has high, medium work rates, left footed with five star skill moves and four star weak foot. Now, as you guys know, we did go ahead and get the Future Stars Academy defenders, and there are a lot of really solid options. If we go ahead and look at Sergio Gomez, left back, left wing back, and center defensive mid position. If we go ahead and look at his in-game stats in a bit more detail, we can see that the card is really well-rounded he has 87 pace with 89 acceleration and 86 sprint speed now honestly he does have some pretty decent pace but at the left back position i do recommend a chem style to make him even more quick now 78 shooting is a very interesting stat for the card if you do want to go ahead and play him as like a left mid or center mid in game i think you can he does have 80 attacking positioning 75 finishing and 80 shot power if you maybe go ahead and give him the hunter chem style going forward he could be really solid as well 90 passing is going to be a very important stat for the card especially down that left hand side 94 crossing 89 short pass and 82 long pass his passing should be very accurate now boys the next stat is why i think that he would make a fantastic center mid 91 dribbling with 99 agility and 98 balance 84 defending another really important stat for the card we do need him to be really solid defensively really good interceptions at 90 85 defensive awareness and 87 stand tackle and then last but not least boys 79 physical for the card 92 stamina is huge if you do want to go ahead and use him as an overlapping fullback and then he does have 71 strength and 82 aggression that's going to be interesting to test out in game because we need him to be a strong defender as well if we jump on over to footman boys we can see that sergio gomez does have six different play styles he has the relentless and block play style plus and then he does also have the incisive pass jockey flair and press proven so a lot of really solid play styles now when it comes to chemistry styles boys there are probably two options that are going to work really well with the card the first one is going to be the shadow chem style yeah you probably guessed it with the shadow chem style he is going to have 95 pace with 97 acceleration and 94 sprint speed should be very quick and it's also going to give him some really nice defensive stats 91 defending overall with 98 interceptions 89 defensive awareness and 95 stand tackle now the second chemistry style that you can go ahead and give the card is the anchor now with the anchor we're not getting the same pace boost the defending is still going to be solid but we are going to go ahead and help out with his physicality he's going to have 79 strength and 86 aggression that's a nice little upgrade right there and if you do want to have a bit of fun with the card and maybe test them out as a center mid in game i do think that the hunter would actually be a really good option as well with the hunter we're getting that same pace boost 95 pace overall but we're also going to go ahead and make his shooting 80 three so that he can be a bit of an attacking threat as well he's gonna have 84 attacking positioning 83 finishing and 84 shot power we are gonna go ahead and test them out as a center mid in today's video as well so that's gonna be very interesting to test out as always boys if you guys do enjoy these fc24 player reviews go ahead and do me a huge favor if you guys can leave a like on today's video and also consider subscribing to the channel if you are new it would be greatly appreciated this is a team we're gonna be using in foot champions to test out the new sergio gomez card we're gonna test them out as a left back left mid and then also as a center mid in the 4-3-2-1 and 4-4 too. I think the card is going to be really good in a lot of different positions. So without further ado, boys, let's go ahead and jump into game number one and let's see how good this card really is. All right, boys, here we are jumping into game number one. And I must say, man, I'm actually really excited to test this card out. We're coming up against like a full Bundesliga German team. It's very cool. But yeah, boys, the plan for game number one is to go ahead and test them out as a left back in the 4-3-2-1 and overlapping fullback. First things first, boys, let's go ahead and test out the card's dribbling. Now, as you guys know, he does have five star skill moves. So if you do play him as a center mid, that's going to be very effective. And this guy just needs to chill out for a second. Dang, boys. But the left stick dribbling on Sergio Gomez is very good. Good ball control right there. The agility and balance, very nice as well. Now, if we go ahead and maybe test out his sprint speed. Boys, down this left-hand side, he's going to be crazy. I can feel it. That's still step over. The acceleration after the step over is really good. I feel like with the shadow or the hunter, he is very quick, which is nice. Very important for a fullback. Left stick dribbling, very good, man. I'm not going to lie, man. His dribbling is probably some of the best that I've used all year in FC24. Five star skill moves as well. He just keeps it so close. Good acceleration. The cutback should get himself an assist, boys. I think that's what he's going to be best at. Running down the left hand side, incorporating his dribbling and his skill moves, and then just looking for cutbacks. That's a good tackle right there as well, man. I think defensively with the shadow should be very good. Ballard, good. Gomez. Ooh, he's actually stepped with Dumfries, but we do get the benefit of the doubt. He does get a bit of jam as well. Gomez, whip it to the back post. That cross is actually really good, man. If Henri's attacking positioning was a little bit better, we would have been in. Millard, Gomez, very good in the tackle, man. That's probably like the second or third tackle that's been really, really good. Now, I do want to go ahead and test out some R1 dribbling. For the most part, we've been doing left stick, but the R1 is good as well. He doesn't have the technical play style. Good cutback, Millard. Oh, I did too much right there. Probably should have just shot. We've pulled him all the way to the left-hand side. Ooh, it's a good tackle, boys. I'm telling you, defensively has been really good. Gomez, good interception as well, man. 
The Shadow Chem Style is a very good option for the card. Gomez, good attacking positioning. We go for a shot. He doesn't have the craziest of finishing. So if you do want to go ahead and use him in a more advanced position, he definitely needs a chem style for that. Gomez, we got track back right here. Ooh, almost got the interception. Gets the tackle though, boys. I will say he isn't the strongest of players, but in game he is a lot stronger than I expected him to be. Gomez again. I want to incorporate some more crosses, man. His passing for the most part has been really good. That's a good ball into Martinelli. Ball roll, cut back, Millard. Good finish. Good finish. It's a good team goal. Uh, Sergio Gomez definitely involved. I'm actually right here. I'm going to try to maybe get him in behind. I don't know if my opponent's going to track the run. He hasn't really tracked the boy Sergio Gomez for vibes on the volley. There's no way. There's no way. What is this goalkeeper doing? Take nothing away from the strike, boys. But I honestly don't know how that went in. We'll take it, though. Gomez. A little bit of space. Whip it into the back post. It's a good ball, man. His crossing, for the most part, has been very good. I just need to get my attackers in a bit better of a position. Now, the one thing that we haven't really tested out with the card is a Trivella. So let's maybe see if we can get him in a good position. Ball roll. Trivella. I don't know, man, but I've, I have this theory where, for some reason, certain fullbacks, even though they don't have crazy long shots, their Trivellas are really OP. Sergio Gomez is one of those players. All right, boys, here we are jumping into game number two. And so far, so good. We're coming up against not a crazy team, if I'm being completely honest. But yeah, boys, game number two, we're going to go ahead and use the man of the hour as a center mid because I think going forward, he has been phenomenal. Nice, Gomez. He does pick up really good positions, boys. Very advanced positions as well. That's a great pass and a lovely assist. Going forward, man, I mean, he's a really good left back. But I feel like he's kind of wasted at the left back position because of how good he is going forward as well. Thierry Henry. We can maybe test out his passing a little bit. My opponent's left me a lot of space through the middle, but we're going to go over the top to Henry. That's literally inch perfect, boys. The pass couldn't have been better. I'm going to try to maybe get Sterling in behind. Test out Gomez's passing a little bit more. That touch right there to get away from the defender was phenomenal. Four-star weak foot as well. So you can definitely incorporate his right foot. Bit of a scrappy play right there. Gomez. Nice. All the way. Look for the cut back. It's a lovely pass, boys. That's what he does best. His passing is so good in game. Right there, the way that we just played it, like in between the goalkeeper and the center back was fa fantastic. Gomez. Ooh, reverse Elastico. Nice. Still with it. Cut back again. Henri. Oh, he's just wide, boys. Good play right there. Look at the pace, boys. Look at the pace on Gomez. All the way. Rides a few challenges as well, man. That's a decent balance. Gomez, left stick dribbling, beautiful, still with it, got triple teamed, I did a little bit too much right there, play it, nice, good football right here boys, Gomez, five star skill moves, look at the sharpness, look at the sharpness of that little spin right there, that's phenomenal, great cutback again, I know it's a bit ratty boys, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, but it works so well in game, one two right here, or we'll just take our space, Gomez, power shot, I'm telling you, boys, it makes no sense. He doesn't have crazy long shots, but for that to find the back of the net, it's a nice thing to incorporate into his game, that's for sure. Very, very advanced position. Could have gone for the pass right there. We'll just open up some more space. Lovely pass, boys. Great pass to Thierry Henry. That's another good assist. We're coming up against a really good team, man. It is a five back. He does also have Rodman. I don't know if she's still extinct on the market. But yeah, boys, in game number three, we are going to go ahead and use him as a left mid in the 4-4-2. Down the line. Let me try to get him in behind. This guy is playing a five back, which is a little bit harder to break down, especially this year in FC24. Gomez, again, the five-star skill moves. Left stick dribbling, very good. Look for the cutback. It's a good one, man. His passing is so good. The incisive pass play style is very nice. Let's go for a team press, man. That might actually help us. Nice, Gomez. Good interception. Whip it into the back post. It's a good cross, man. I feel like the crossing, if he had the whipped pass, would have been so much better. Shouldn't have forced it, but a good interception. Gomez, easy pass into Millard. It's going to be an easy goal if we score right here. Off oh, of the crossbar, boys. That's unlucky, man. That would have been a good assist. Millard, Gomez, little step over right there. Test out the finishing. It's not great, boys. Definitely needs the hunter. Gomez, nice. Ball roll. Trying to go down the byline. Look at that, boys. The dribbling is honestly cracked. Go for a finish. We'll take it, boys. That's actually a pretty decent uh, goal right there. Now, I will say, man, he's not very clinical, but sometimes when you get him into like good areas, he will uh, manage to score. Gomez. Nice. Ooh, boys, that turn is so sharp. Ball roll, Trivella. 
It's cracked, man. Cracked. I would I would personally play him as a center mid. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That is us using the new Future Stars Evolution, Sergio Gomez, in a few games of Foot Champions. And to be completely honest, man, a really solid player. Now, if we go ahead and dissect his in-game stats in a bit more detail, man, the 87 pace with the Shadow Chem style, he does have 97 acceleration and 94 sprint speed. And for the most part, man, he was extremely quick. I think whether you play him as a left back, left mid, or center mid, I do think that the Shadow Chem style is probably the best option for the card. 78 shooting, man. I mean, the finishing in and around the box wasn't great he does pick up really good areas with his attacking positioning but for some reason man his shot power and his long shots even though it's 80 and 78 they were really solid in game especially his trivelas 90 passing is a very important stat for the card and his passing for the most part in game was very accurate he does have the incisive pass play style for me personally boys 91 dribbling was the standout stat for the card with his five star skill moves 99 agility 98 balance he is extremely quick and swift on the ball i feel like you can create a lot of chances with this dribbling man the left stick dribbling is absolutely cracked in game now with the shadow chem style his defending is a lot better and i do think that defensively he was really solid as a left back his interceptions were really good he does have some pretty decent defensive awareness as well but most surprisingly man his stand tackle his stand tackle was really good and then last but not least boys 79 physical for the card he isn't the strongest of players but he does kind of make up for it with his aggression and then the stamina very important if you do want to go ahead and play him as a center mid or as an overlapping fullback overall boys i'm gonna go ahead and give the card a 9.2 out of 10 rating i really enjoyed using him in foot champ i love the versatility with the card i think he makes a great left back he makes a great left mid and then he makes a fantastic center mid as well me personally boys i would go ahead and play him as a center mid and maybe like the 4-3-2-1 because his passing and dribbling is absolutely cracked in the game you can definitely play him as a fullback but for some reason man i don't know when you when you have a player with five star skill moves with the really high passing really good dribbling i think as a left back he's kind of wasted but again boys for 20 games of squad battles division rivals or foot champions out of all the players that you can go ahead and evolve he definitely has to be top three but that is going to be the end of today's video boys if you guys did enjoy it let me know by leaving a like like, comment down below what player you guys would like to see next in another player review. And then also consider subscribing to the channel if you are new, boys. It would be greatly appreciated. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for clicking on today's video. I've been your boy, Boobad. I'll catch you guys in another one very, very soon. Peace.